and I guess I'll get close to the mic, and this is the woman who took magical shits. There once was a woman who took magical shits. She made her poopies here, and she made her poopies there, and each time was a new scene with great adventures. But once on a wet spring day with the frenzy of civilization hurling past her, the woman became confused. So she stopped eating and could not make any more boopies. Then the real world assailed her fiercely. The winds howled their fearsome howls and there was strange laughter and loneliness. The woman became afraid. There is no compassion in the world, she thought. Just as existential doom seized the woman's heart, a man appears. He is the child Horus come again, the eon of great minds and hell hearts. He is magnanimous, alert. He commences discussion about the mind and the passion, all drivel to the woman who is wearing a propeller hat. The seasons pass by, ages are lost, but then the fierce wisdom of our father Odin in Valhalla pulls the woman up from the sadness. She contemplates the various wise sayings and attains a greater sense of justice. Now her brain has become connected to a vast neural network of fashionably colored people, all pretty much the same. There is an old lady with crochet needles operating the flow of electrons. She has a scaly-breasted lorikeet on her right shoulder, and she clearly looks confused. There are larger forces at work, a need for transcendence from the mundane. Across the street, a taco shack shredded grilled steak with fresh cilantro. The woman loses her mind. She unplugs herself from the old lady and shits fiercely. She is now a child of the universe, pure devotion. She understands her body. She knows how to enjoy friends. There is goodness, there is passion, and there is shit. Understanding these things brings new light. One may make poopies for better or for worse, thought the woman. One may have extensive discourse about it, but what is life if not the regular elimination of waste? Thank you.